so I've been wanting to get my nails, ex not my nails, my eyelashes extended. Not like with just the individual lashes, but um, you know where they actually take the individual lash and attach it to your individual lash. And I think it take like a couple hours. The girl's supposed to be here at uh, three o'clock to do that. So right now I got so much other stuff to get done. So I'll be here for a while. Stay tuned, y'all. I'm just kicking it. They found me a nice little spot in Boca. I hope they do a good job so I can keep coming back and have a regular um, nail tech. So stay tuned. <laughs> What up, cut ups? I'm just getting home from the nail salon. I got my nails done, guys. Okay. Cute. The little designs. I never had this like holographic type design. I think that's what you call it, but I think they did a good job overall. Cute. <laughs> I love the bright color because I just thought it went with Florida, Florida. Okay. So anyway, I have to go back tomorrow at five o'clock too, which I really, mm, I don't know if I'm going to keep the appointment. I'm going to try to, I might take an Uber, you know, because I have been getting lost guys. I got lost yesterday. I didn't even go that far away, but I got lost. And then she made my appointment late at five o'clock tomorrow. I don't know. I mean, it's it's a little bit after five now. And it's, you see, it's, it's going to be getting dark soon. So she said the process take about an hour and a half, um, depending on if I want them natural looking or, or fuller. So I'm going to get the fuller ones. So that might take an hour and a half. So hope it's cute. I've been hearing a lot about it. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and go for it. So. Stay tuned in for this fish, guys. I've been hearing so much about. Stay tuned. Okay, everybody, I'm back with this conch fish. Now, guys, I, I kind of overcooked it a little bit. Well, I didn't cook it, but I, I warmed it up. So some pieces is burnt a little bit, even though I, I don't mind burnt. This is what the conch fish look like, you know. So... I think this is like a, a Caribbean um, recipe or Caribbean type of, uh, like a fish that they eat a lot in the Caribbean, guys. Looks a little different. I think this is the biggest piece. So, that's what it looks like. So, it's shaped different, very different. But okay, let me get started. Anyway, I got some hot sauce right here, guys. Let me just... Hot sauce on here. Mm. I'm gonna move this up a little bit, just a little bit. Get down so y'all can see. Because I am just sitting here. I don't, I don't, and the table is. I should have the table on this side, but it's not. So let's move this over a little bit. Okay. This is the conch fish, and I'm putting some hot sauce on it, guys. Okay, now. I did taste a little piece of it last night when it was fresh from the restaurant when I got it. And it was super good. It was really seasoned. Seasoned very, very well. So, here's the piece that's less burnt. I'm going to give this one a try, guys, first. All right. Okay. Wow. Mm. Wow. <clears throat> now, what I have to say about this fish is that the texture of it is different. Okay. Mm. Even if I didn't 
leave it in the oven for too long, the texture is different. It's a lot more chewier than your average fish, okay? Hmm. Even last night when I tried it, a bit of it, it was a bit chewy. But it was just, it was good. It was seasoned. And I know I should have the name for y'all, but I don't. I may have it by the time I upload the video, though. <laughs> I have to ask. To me, it kind of has the texture of um, clams. Mm -hmm, fried clams. <laughs> kind of look like big fried clams, too. If you ever had clams before, it's going to look like big fried clams. Mm-hmm. Different. Or very different. But I heard that a lot of people were eating this fish and it was really good. I see how different it is. It is. Mm. It's good though. Mm hmm Oh. It definitely got the texture of a clam. Mm hmm. A bit chewy. I'm going out on another day mm -hmm. with my friend, special friend. Mm hmm. Tonight, I don't know where we're going yet. Mm. I think we just may do seafood. A little bit of seafood, job. Mmm. Mm-hmm. We did steak the other night. But before that, I think we had, I'm supposed to know. Oh, yeah, I do. It was a very fine Japanese restaurant that we went to. And you know what? Mm. I still got some of the rice and peppers in there. I had... I think it was chicken. I forgot. But I know it had rice, red, and green peppers. I forgot the meat. I really did. Mm. But. Mm. Crunchy. People sitting outside in the pool area, kicking it. Mm -hmm. So, I guess to Floridians, when it's about sixteen degrees or maybe even a little bit higher. I guess that's considered cold to them. <laughs> wow. Mm. I know that the people in Milwaukee, if it was 60 degrees, would be outside in their flip-flops and their shorts. They really would. They really would. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I think I'm in the mood for some seafood, y'all. Some real seafood. Mm -hmm. Let me see how I go. 
Mm-hmm. We'll see. But one thing about it, about moving here to a whole new place, is learning my way around, guys. Now, that is going to be... Well, the Wi-Fi man came in today and he told me that um, going east and west of Boca Raton is only about seven miles, but going north and south can take you to Miami. He told me that you don't have, because I thought you had to take the highway to get there. He said that they have streets here that take you there where you don't have to take, get on the highway. I got to go, y'all. Hold on. Ooh, shit. Okay, y'all. Yeah, that was my money. Okay. Y'all, YouTube is really, really slow about sending the money, you know. Um, to me, you see, it's about to get dark. Like, yeah, you sent the money, but shit, I really... I just got in, you know, now the, the day is over. Like, I, I wish that they could send it a, lo a lot earlier. Matter of fact, last month, y'all, I was so mad because I came to Florida for Christmas on the 21st on payday. That's when I came here. Well, Pompano. And... Y'all, I was, I was just snapping and mad because I got all the way to the hotel. And I'm thinking, that, you know, my money going to be on there, okay? Because I, I got to the hotel, I think, after 7. Like, after 7, shit. You, you would think, damn, you'll have your little money. Mm-mm. Y'all -mm. got to the hotel. I ain't have it, so I had to make a phone call. And the hotel was over $500 to stay for the week, close to six. But I have to make a call to have someone pay that for me, okay? Well, I had to pay them back. But the point is, it took all damn day for YouTube to just send the damn money. Wow. Mm. So... As soon as I got, <laughs> I'm talking about Murphy's Law. I think I talked about it too. But as soon as I got in the room, y'all, okay, damn money popped on there, direct deposit. And I was like, really? You know, it's just, just so fucking stupid. You know, I just, I really wish, I'm done with this. I really wish that there was, hmm. Another way, or if they can give it out a lot quicker, that would be helpful. But, um, yeah, guys, so what I'm going to do is probably get going because I know that I, I need to get myself together, even though, honestly, I'm pretty much together. I'm not going to do anything else. Um, <laughs> I didn't even fill in my brows today, y'all. I didn't uh, put any lashes on. It's a, a plain face today. So be it. Um, hopefully tomorrow evening. I think I'm going to take an Uber tomorrow. Yeah. I don't want to get lost. I think I'm going to Uber it there and Uber it back. It's less than 10 minutes away from here. So it's, it's kind of close. But I just don't want to take a chance and get lost. Okay. Especially at night. Because I'm very direction deaf at night. So... I'm gonna steal one more piece of this conk. I'm gonna be through with the video, y'all. The one with some hot sauce on it. Mmm. It's different. Very different. Mm -mm. Different texture. Get a bite. Get a bite. Hey, y'all. Let me ask y'all something. Now, 
But I was in a nail salon. I was in there for a minute, you know. I'm on YouTube. Checking out people's videos and stuff. Liking and hearting the comments on mine. Good or bad. Mm. I need to let y'all know. I know some of y'all don't know. Y'all keeping those comments going. Y'all are getting me paid. So really, I need to thank y'all. Okay? Because I talked to my sister, Bethany. And Bethany Ben told me, you know. She said, girl, just silence is key. Don't say nothing. And you know what? Since it's getting out of hand, I'm talking about my YouTube, guys. I have over 10,000 comments. No, 11. Since it's getting so out of hand, guys, I just think that I'm going to get somebody else to do it. I'm going to hire someone to a social media manager. Me and Bethany did talk about that, but she also just told me, hey, you know, because she was like, they blowing me up, they blowing me up, they blowing me up. An email, everything, blowing me up about the video yesterday. And all I can say is that my sister stayed neutral. Okay, she didn't get in it. She did not. She did tell Walt the right thing to do, though. Okay. And all I'm saying is this, guys. My sister said, silence. Okay. Now, this time, I'm going to take her advice, except for a couple people. You know, if I recognize somebody comment you know I'll, I'll leave a little comment back or something like that but for the most part and all of the hate comments y'all y'all can keep it coming as far as i'm concerned i'm gonna be very honest keep that shit coming because you're gonna see a change in me i'm not gonna react the way i know a lot of people want me to sorry i'm in a whole new surrounding okay um it, i just don't you know, I'm not feeding into it, y'all. I don't let motherfuckers control me and shit. So, y'all can't do me like y'all did, uh, Miss Cindy. I, I'm, not, I ain't, I'm not her. I, I'm made in a whole different way. You see, I ain't turning my comments off. Never. That's the money. So, thank y'all. But all I can say is, y'all keep watching, okay? Keep watching. All right. Appreciate it. <laughs> Appreciate it. Wait. This will be off. Mm -hmm. Y'all keep watching, though. I know y'all is, anyway. Y'all keep watching. I'm gonna nail time today, y'all. Cute. Mm -hmm. Cute. You know, I like how he put the little red right there. Little red diamond. Right there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I'm living my life. Doing what I do. Oh, we. I know y'all was mad. Some of y'all. Oh, we. A lot of y'all mad. Mad, mad, mad. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What we gonna do about that? Y'all, let me tell y'all, I'm going to keep making my videos. Keep doing me like I do, okay? And I'll let y'all know what's going on. Y'all ain't got to worry. I'm just make sure y'all keep commenting, okay? Keep commenting, please. Because I do have to say... It's a little comical, y'all. Y'all get me a big, fat one. Like I told Bethany yesterday, she thought it was so funny. I said, girl, I'm going to roll a big one. Go home and smoke, read them comments, and laugh my ass off, and continue to heart and like them. Most of the comments. I think all of them. So, y'all, I ain't, I ain't feeding into it. My mind is not that weak. Okay? I know what my focus is, and I know what I need to do. So... I don't let people deter me or my thought process. So, at the end of the day, y'all have a good day. Everybody out there. Oops. See y'all later.